Hi guys, welcome back to Fertility Friday. Today we'll be talking about what to expect at your initial consultation and also the initial infertility workup. An infertility evaluation starts with a complete history and physical exam. It's always better to have both partners present at the visits if at all possible. In the history, we'll ask questions such as how long have you been trying to conceive, if there were any previous testing or treatments done, menstrual cycle regularity, previous pregnancy history, past medical and surgical history, medications, previous history of any pelvic infections, and family history, amongst other things. We are essentially looking for any risk factors that may be clues as to why it's been challenging to conceive. We'll then move on to the ultrasound. We perform the ultrasound transvaginally so we get the most optimal views of the female reproductive tract. We'll start with looking at the uterus and we'll assess the uterine position, the size, the shape. We'll look for any fibroids or polyps. We'll assess the endometrium and the cervix. We'll then look at the ovaries, assessing the size, if any cysts are present, and the antral follicle count. The fallopian tubes are a very small structure and we typically do not see them on an ultrasound. At the end of the visit, we'll discuss the basic elements of the infertility evaluation, which include checking ovarian reserve, which we do with three tests typically, a day three FSH and estrogen level, an AMH, and an antral follicle count. We'll check the structure of the uterine cavity and tubal patency with an HSG or a hysterosalpingogram, and we'll check a semen analysis. We'll also do some preconception labs at this visit, including a blood type, checking for immunity against rubella and varicella, and also offering genetic carrier screening. We may do additional labs based on the patient's history at this visit. After this is completed, we'll plan to meet a few weeks later to discuss the results of the workup and also to discuss the next steps. In the next series of videos, we'll look at the elements of the infertility workup in more detail. Hi guys, I hope you enjoyed the content. If you did, give us a like, comment below. You can always follow me on Facebook or Instagram, or you can also subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks for watching and see you next time.